Previously on Total Drama, Revenge of the Island, the campers got deep with an underwater scavenger hunt. Mike's alter ego, Vito, pumped his way into Anne Maria's heart and under Zoe's skin. And Mike's other alter ego, Svetlana, threw down some gold medal moves in the water skiing challenge. In the end, Don was tossed for swiping everybody's stuff, even though it was really Scott. Sneaky. It's now Team Maggot versus Team Rat. Will the rats man up before they're a man down? Let's hope not. There is nothing more entertaining than a man down. <laughs> more where that came from right now on Total Drama Revenge of the Island. The moment that I'm doing fine, you guys are on my mind. You asked me what I wanted to be, and now I think the answer is plain to see. turn yet? Ah, keep your panties on. Eesh. Nice hair. Looks like Princess Leia lost a scissor fight. Actually, it's more like Queen Amidala. More like Queen Amidorka. <laughs> <laughs> now that is how you do hair. I'll pass on the frilly, girly hair care. Thank you. going to stop those maggots, for we are a team of men. To team men. Team, team men. men. Men till the end. Yeah. Yikes. What's with the circus thumb? Oh, this thing? That's 10 years of gaming right there. Video games? Listen, champ, we are men. You are a smelly ball of dough with ears. Smelly? Hey, gamers are athletes, too. We've got keen hand-eye coordination. Cat-like reflexes. Watch. <laughs> Come to Papa Cheesy. And boom! Ooh, huh? wow. See, guys? Ah! That stings! <laughs> <laughs> reflexes. Cat-like. So maybe that wasn't the best way to show my skills, but I'm totally out of practice. Chris confiscated my last handheld yesterday. I haven't played a video game in 14 hours, 5 minutes, and 22 seconds! <laughs> Can someone please send me a game console? It's challenge time! Campers, meet me on the other side of the island! Hey, Zoe, really like your hair. Let me guess, and your character, Vito, likes Anne Maria's hair? I really thought Mike was a nice guy. But either he's into me or Anne Maria. Pick a side, okay? My multiple personalities are really messing things up with Zoe, especially Vito. I never thought I'd have so much trouble just keeping my shirt on. Welcome to your challenge the weird and wild fashion spectacular. Fashion? Now you're talking. Ugh, fashion. Waste of time. So says the girl in men's prison sweats. Hey, nobody needs to be reminded that I'm a girl. Sorry, who's a girl? Zip it! You won't be walking the catwalk. No, 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 no. No amount of fashion can help you people. <laughs> Here's how it's gonna work. Each team gets a wardrobe of clothes, a makeup kit, and 10 minutes to dress and make up a model, which you'll send down the runway to be judged by myself, chef, and today's total drama classic competitor, Lindsay. Yay! 
Don't you just love my new special fashion judgy shoes? Wow! We get to dress an actual model. Uh-huh. Right after you catch one. Catch a model? Child's play. The way they eat, they'll pass out after three steps. Did I say human models? Don't think so. No, your models are in there. They're wild, they're mutated, and like me, despise teenagers. Okay, fashionista, go! What's this doing here? Hmm. Too bad there's pepperoni on it, otherwise I totally eat that. <laughs> oh, perfect. No pepperoni. Oh. Which one do we use? Well, maybe we should find something that can't eat us. Five minutes, people! Hey, guys, how about that slimy maggot? The one that's the size of a beagle. <laughs> It'd be a cinch to catch and dress. We could just slide it down the runway. Killer idea, Bubble Boy. All right, step aside and let me work. This maggot's got to look banging. Come on, guys. There's got to be something on this island we can catch. How about that critter? Uh, I don't know, guys. I mean, how are we gonna get it out of there and dress it in time? Firepower! The only way to take down a formidable enemy. Come on! Men, you are looking at a live DDB. Detonating duffel bag. It can forcibly dress any target within its 60-foot blast radius. Clothes, glue, and a little bit of fertilizer. We'll just blast the duds on him! Now that is how a man gets dressed! Army boots, puffy vests, jock straps. Guys, this is a fashion show. We need chic, sophisticated, coordinated looks. And I know just who to talk to. <laughs> oh, yeah. Do I got style or what? Uh, um, I agree with the maggot. Three minutes remaining. We're running out of time. If you guys don't mind, I'll take a crack at it. <laughs> Dakota, when you're done cleaning up the environment, could you get me another drink? Thanks. <sighs> Dakota, hey. Uh, can I help? Aw, you're such a gentleman. <laughs> Do you think you could give me some fashion tips? I mean, you're so well put together, even when working with toxic waste. You want my advice? Really? No one ever asked me for my advice. Sure, I'd be happy to help. Okay, this is major top secret. Like, three whole seasons ahead secret. Stripes. They are so on trend. Stripes, of course. Thanks, Dakota, you're an angel. There, what do you think? Too much, too little, be honest. Unless you hate it. Wow, Zoe, not bad. It's not good, either. One minute! It's fine. We're not spending all day on this. Let's get back to Chris. The strap duffel bomb is ready for the big game. Go long! <laughs> ah! uh -oh. It's Freaky Forest Fashion Time! Maggoteers, show me something fierce. Chef, drop that needle. 
This gorgeous plus-size maggot is showing off a bold retro fashion like no other. Her swank new hairdo perfectly complements a dynamite vintage 60s go-go dress. Ugh. Little gross, what with the oozing and squirming. I give it an 8.5! Yeah! yeah! Hey! What? what? Oops. Okay, show me what you got, rats. Rats? Ah! As you can see, Yeti is wearing a smart bohemian striped ensemble. The outfit consists of a variety of garments applied forcefully to random parts of his body. <gasps> that thing is huge! <laughs> Ew, horizontal stripes. Sam, I meant vertical stripes. Horizontals just make you look fat. They do? <laughs> True. It hardly complements the Yeti's husky physique. Hey, what are you guys doing? I called you here to take pictures of me! <laughs> Chris is right! Stripes are so... <laughs> hey, he took my jetpack! Uh-huh. Will Lindsay survive? And am I legally liable if she doesn't? Find out after the break. What do you mean I'm liable if the Yeti eats Lindsay? It's not my fault she's delicious. Gotta go. Hey, hey, hey. For our next challenge, the two teams will compete to rescue Lindsay. Yep, that's it. Everyone grab a canoe and head to Boney Island. <laughs> it's all good. Way to go with the fashion tips. Sorry, guys. I haven't played a video game for so long, my brain's not working. Huh? <laughs> uh, did you guys see that just now? See what? Chris is gonna merge the teams any day now, so it's time to start working on the maggots. Hmm, Zoe's ripe for the plucking. And you ask anybody on the farm back home, I'm a great plucker. No. No. Scott, are you okay? This is all my fault. What do you mean? My team voted off Dawn behind my back. And she's the only one who could talk to that big ape. Lindsay is doomed. <laughs> oh, don't blame yourself. It'll all work out in the end. You'll see. Poor Scott. Who knew he had a sensitive side? <laughs> <laughs> Guys! The Yeti! Oh, it's okay, Yeti. The world just can't handle beauty like yours. You're a snowflake, but just like a lot bigger. Like, I mean, a lot. What's with all the scaffolding? I'm turning Boney Island into my personal resort. The health department said it was unfit for human life, but I sent in workers anyway. Hmm. Wonder where they went. Down hard him! He just has big hairy body issues! Oh, I hear that. I mean, uh, did you hear that? He's got issues! We've got to take that Psycho Yeti out! That is what Team Rat is going to do! Take this, hairball! <laughs> Fine. I'll stay away from fashion from now on. Happy? <laughs> Men, we'll make a three-pronged play against the Yeti. One player on the left, 
One on the right and one straight down the middle. What about Private Pudding? Gamer Boy? Ah, uh, he's useless. Look at him. He's in his own little world. Ugh. Need game. Any game. <laughs> Team men, go! How are we gonna rescue Lindsay before they do? Perhaps we can get someone prettier than Lindsay to lure the Yeti away. Oh, hey, I got the goods. But no way am I running up that junk pile in these shoes. Well, I guess maybe I could try. Maggots, break out the beauty products. I'm going in. I do this only for the good of the team. It's not makeup, it's war paint. Yeah, go team man. Shabam! Game world, my ultimate gamer dream come true. Still one life left. It's all on me now. Let's do this! <laughs> wow, Soft Sir's booking it. Beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop. Sam, look out! Beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop. Beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop. Okay, you're sure this will make me look good? Right? Oh, uh, yeah. The only person who could give you a smoking hot makeup job like this is me. Or a circus clown. Hey! Hurry, Sam's making good time. Oh, man, we're never gonna... <gasps> man, for the love of Pete, you're not paying the Sistine Chapel. It's just makeup! <clears throat> Step aside! Dang fool, kids. Just get some rouge on her and there, done! Finally! Huh. Ah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> wow, now I know what they mean by drop-dead knockout. <laughs> oh, Yeti, your princess is here. Um, Joe, you should probably look... Relax, that poor Yeti won't know what hit him. Whoa, what did you guys do to Joe? Uh, what we did to Joe? Ah, <laughs> 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 oh boy. Could really use a power-up. Come on, Sam. You're almost there! Go get him, you crazy couch potato! You can do it, Sam! Ah! Ah! Game over! Am I done all my lives? Uh, hey, uh, sweet little hairball. Feel like a tall glass of gorgeous? See? That's another what not to do. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's so funny, you big ape? <laughs> Those were some pretty great moves up there. Thanks. People don't give us gamers much credit, but... Oh! That'll teach you to laugh at a beautiful lady! Team Maggot, you've got immunity. Yeah! yeah! Oh, come on! Let me see that. Huh? <gasps> Just add some rouge, huh? Hey, Chester, here's a makeover for you! Uh, what did I do? What did I do? <laughs> Someone help! As much as I'd love to let this go on forever, it's time to head back to camp. Rats, you've got some voting to do. Well, that was a complete fiasco. Brick, you bagged yourself a fashion fail. And Sam, you just totally dropped the barrel on this one. So, one of the rats is going home tonight. But it's not gonna be Lightning or Scott. You're both safe. Just sweet! Now then, the toxic marshmallow of loserdom goes to... Sam! Uh, ow! Well... Looks like I'm out of continues. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't have been more help to you guys. Semper Fi. Sit down, fool. Ah! Thank you, Chef. Now for something very special. Mutant maggots, you're probably wondering why I asked you to sit in on this elimination ceremony. I'll need a strong volunteer from each team. Right here. 
Ditto. Pack your bags. You're hurling them, too? Nah, I don't give people time to pack before they get hurled. These two are switching teams. <gasps> hey, teammate. <laughs> welcome to my team. No, welcome to my team. <laughs> oh yeah! Team Man remains 100% dude! Ow! Get your eyes checked, jockstrap! Any last words before your ride to loserdom? Yeah, can I get all my handheld game systems back now? <sighs> Sam, wait! Hey, you came to see me off. Aw, uh, I'm gonna miss you. Here, call me, okay? I may have lost the game, but I won the heart of the girl of my dreams! <laughs> Oops. Who will be the next loser hurl? How much can we humiliate them first? And will lightning ever learn the difference between guys and girls? What girl? Find out next time on Total Drama! Revenge of the Island! So, do you guys know where the boat is?